hi guys welcome back to my channel so today I have another video for you guys I'm gonna be showing you how I do this really nice summer protective style using my uncle funky's daughter products and Janet collections easy text braiding hair this video is a little long because it's quite detailed so definitely grab a snack sit tight and let's jump straight into the video Welcome back to my channel so today I have another video for you guys I am going to be showing you how I did these um, twists really really nice chunky twists um, on my natural hair I'm actually going to be flat twisting my hair then I'm going to be adding these at the ends to kind of give me some length I usually see all these braided twisted styles on Instagram and I haven't done one in years because like my hair is very very thick and to go and sit down for someone else to braid or twist my hair for me is just uh, I can't even imagine doing that so I decided to do a, like a little experiment and I, try, I decided to try to do a little something for myself and I actually really really like the way this turned out I mean it's not perfect but at least it looks okay in my opinion so yeah I'm gonna show you exactly how I did it it's actually very easy and very quick to do I'm gonna be using Uncle Funky's daughter product as usual and I'm also gonna be using the Janet collection easy text braiding hair that is what I actually have here so yeah if you're not already subscribed please go ahead and click that subscribe button down below turn on your notification bell so that you'll be notified for when I upload my videos and without further ado sit tight and let's jump straight into the video Okay, so I'm going to start by moisturizing my hair. I already sectioned off my hair, so I'm going to show you how I do the sections as the video goes on. So first, I'm going to be starting with Thirsty Curl, which is a leave-in curl revitalizer. So it's basically a lightweight um, revitalizing or refreshing mist that hydrates and conditions your hair and just gives life to your hair. Um, it's perfect if you're on the go and just want to spray something quickly in your hair it's a really really good leave-in next I'm going to be taking super curl which is an extra moisturizing um, very lightweight creamy butter which is also perfect for the summertime I like to use extra butter which is a thicker version during the winter and I use super curl for the summertime because it's just perfect it gives my hair a lot of moisture and yeah just keeps everything protected next I'm going to be applying curly magic and as you can see I'm applying that directly at my roots it has a very soft gel like consistency so it's great for applying to your roots basically soften your roots before you do any braided or twisted style and um yeah it's also perfect for wash and goes during the summer so if you like if your hair can do wash and goes if you like doing wash and goes you can definitely use curly magic to achieve a very nice wash and go that will not leave your hair crunchy or flaky so i'm just doing my flat twist now and as you can see that is my first section i have about I'm gonna have about 10 flat twists when I'm done. So yeah, this is the first flat twisted section and I'm starting from the back. Just going from um, the top part of one ear, of my right ear down to the bottom around the back of my neck, my neck area. So I'm just gonna finish up that flat twist. So this is the first section as you can see how I section it off right at the back there so now I'm gonna be doing the second section as usual I'm spraying my water applying thirsty curl as my leave-in then I'm going to apply super curl as my moisturizer that also gives my hair amazing shine and has a wonderful smell uncle Funky's daughter products have amazing smells like every single product has a really nice smell then I'm gonna apply my curly magic at my edges why do I keep saying edges at my roots sorry then I am going to flat twist as you can see I'm applying a lot of product because I just want my hair to be really soft and easy for me to flat twist So now for the next section, um, I hope you guys are really paying attention to how I'm doing my sections. Like I said, I sectioned my hair off camera 
so um because it was really difficult for me to section on camera for you guys to see i had to do it off camera so i could make sure that my parts were re as neat as possible but yeah um as i'm turning my head around and rotating i'm doing that so that you guys will be able to see the positioning and the sectioning of my flat twist so i have about four flat twists done now so once again i'm just showing you guys how i sectioned how i did my sections how i positioned them and you don't have to do it exactly the way I did mine. You can basically do your pattern however you like. You can do more than 10 flat twists if you want. You can do way more. But since I wanted my twists to be very thick and chunky and like one wanted jumbo twists, I did 10. So yeah, you can also modify it depending on the thickness of your hair. So right now I'm done with the back. I had five flat twists at the back. I'm working on the front now. I've applied my moisturizer and I'm applying curly magic to my roots. So now I'm going to start flat twisting the front coming forward. So as you can see, I already did one in front. So this is basically the second one. And like I also said, you can do your sections however you like. You can do the pattern however you like. Just um, make sure that when you're done, all the twists are coming to one side of your face. Okay, so I'm just finishing up my flat twist. Like I said, I did five flat twists in front and five at the back, all coming to one side of my face. And I did this at night. So when I was done, I just basically went to bed. And the next morning, I'm going to be adding in some extensions to give me some length. Because of the nature of this style, regardless of the length of your hair, when you're done doing it, you're going to your hair is going to shrink a lot. Especially if you have type 4, 4B, 4C hair, it's going to really shrink. So if you want some length, you're going to have to add in some um, extensions so yeah I'm gonna add in that as the video goes on but this is how my flat twists are looking when I'm done very chunky and very thick flat twists so the next morning I'm going to be adding in my hair the extra hair as you can see I already did one section in front just to test and um, yeah, this is the hair I'm going to be adding. So I'm going to be using the Janet Collection Easy Text 84 inch braiding hair. Um, it's a new blend of fibers called Easy Text and it's hypoallergenic, antifungal, antibacterial, anti itch. So I know a lot of people complain about some types of braiding hair itching or irritating their body. Well, with this, you don't have to really worry about that because it's basically pre treated. You can also dip this in hot water if you want to curl it, it's very lightweight and soft. And right now I'm showing you the color 1B30, that's the ombre color. I have four colors, I have 1B, 1B30, 30 and 613. So this is 1B30 and you, as you guys can see it's a very beautiful ombre color. The color gradient between the 1B and the 30 is very seamless. Um, it's a really nice color melt from 1B to the 30. A lot of times when you have ombre hair, the colors are very choppy. You can see that the line of demarcation where you have the 1B and the 30. But this, the way the colors are blended together is very nice. And as you can see, this is the amount of hair I take to do my jumbled twist. Yeah, about the amount. So I loosen up my flat twist to the roots. That is where I'm going to be adding in the extension here. So I take the piece, wrap my hair and the piece together on both sides so both the left and the right side just basically wrap my hair and the twist together i know this part might be a little difficult if you don't know how to add in braiding hair but i promise if you practice a bit you will get used to adding in braiding hair so when my hair is wrapped around it i'm just going to start twisting regularly twisting like normal and i'm twisting it very firmly now if you notice the part that I added the braiding hair looks a bit thinner than the rest of my hair, the rest of the flat twist and the rest of the twist that I'm doing but that's because that's where we added in the hair and I twisted it very firmly. As we're twisting that place is going to loosen up and it will all be the same size from my root to the end. So as you can see as we're twisting it's beginning to loosen up that point where we added in the hair and everything is looking like the same size now so i'm just going to twist firmly up until the end now this hair is very long so what i've 
started doing eventually was basically wrapping the hair around my neck so I could finish this thing. So as you can see right now, that place doesn't look thinner anymore. It just looks like one seamless, chunky jumbo twist. So now, right now, I have the 1B and the 1B Petty. And as you can see, I haven't dipped it in hot water, and that is how it's looking. You can literally take this out of the pack and use it to braid your hair immediately. Now, this is the color 30. Um, I'm taking out my section again, and I'm adding it, and I'm just going to do my flat twist. like I said I have color 1B, color 1B30, color 13 and 613. I just decided to play around with the colors to see how it will turn out. Initially I was gonna do all black but I just decided to experiment this in the summertime and uh, yeah you just do different stuff during the summer. But yeah you can twist this all the way to the ends and as you can see it has very natural looking ends because the hair is pre-stretched so you don't even have to go in and stretch the hair before you use it. Like I said you can literally take it out of the pack and use it directly like that okay so now I'm adding in the 613 the same way I added in the others and I'm just gonna twist it up until the ends now I'm adding in the black like I said you just have to practice on how to add in the extended hair to your own hair yeah when you practice it, you eventually get used to it so basically I did um, three blacks, three 1B30s, two color 30s, and two 613s, and I'm just trimming the ends to finish up the look. And this is what it looks like. I'm just gonna turn around so you guys can see. Like I said, doing this while recording, this was the nicest and the cleanest I was able to get my parts. So yeah, just make sure you get your parts as clean and as nice as possible. The better the parts look, the better the style is going to come out. So to finish off the look, I'm just going to be using the Funk which is a hair refresher tonic. You can use it for twisted and braided styles, um, even under wigs, you can use it for locks and it's basically um, a scalp refresher mist that just basically helps to neutralize odors and um, remove any buildup um, or dirt or oil or um, sweat that can cause buildup. So I just basically spray that onto my scalp and massage it in and um, it's great for protective styles in general and it just keeps your scalp very fresh and healthy and clean so yeah this is basically the final look um this style is actually quite easy to do because you're not doing a lot of twists i only did 10 flat twists and added in my extensions you can do this in less than an hour especially if you're good at flat twisting um you can definitely rock this to so many events it's a beautiful summer style you can wear it on vacation and to so many different places so yeah let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section and i'll see you guys in my next video okay so thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope the tutorial was kind of easy for you guys to follow let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section let me know if you liked it let me know if you've done something like this before let me know let me even know if you have like any suggestions and thoughts on stuff that I could have done better to make the style come out nicer but yeah all the products I use are from Uncle Funky's daughter you can find your products at Target and you can also shop online at UncleFunky'sDaughter.com and use my code West African Baby for 15% off I don't make any money off that code it's literally just for you guys to have a discount when you shop so yeah I'm gonna list all the products down below Uncle Funky's daughter also has a travel size kit <laughs> so yeah, Uncle Funky's daughter also has a travel size kit where you can get all your products. So if you're going to be traveling this summer, this is something that would definitely come in handy. And um, it has all the products you need to complete in full style and keep your hair healthy and protected. Midnight Train, Super Curl, Extra Butter, Curly Magic and Thirsty Curl. So everything I actually used in this video, the big sizes, you have them in the travel kit as well. So yeah, definitely get your hands on this if you're going to be traveling. It's super, super efficient. Um, and it comes in this little nice pouch so you know all your products are in one place. And yeah, the hair, the braiding hair I used as well. I'm also going to link that down below. This braiding hair is one of the best, I, if not the best, I've actually ever used. This is actually the best that I've 
felt the best that I've used the best that I've seen so yeah it's really nice I did not dip these in hot water and see how the ends look like I only just twisted it right up to the ends and I didn't have to dip it in hot water or anything like that the hair is super soft it doesn't like rub on my skin like this is this is really nice this braiding hair is really 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 nice so yeah you don't even have to like stretch it or draw it or feather it when you take it out of the pack it's already stretched for you it's already drawn for you so yeah you can just take it out of the pack and use it to twist or use it to braid so that was like the best part because like stretching um hair and it can be so so stressful and so confusing and so messy with hair getting everywhere and all that stuff so i absolutely love this braiding hair i would a hundred and two thousand percent recommend it to anybody that wants to get it like this is a good very good investment and it also comes in so many different colors on the website as well there was burgundy and like different many different colors i only had four so those were the four that i showed you guys in this video the 613 the 30 1b30 and the 1b it would be perfect for braids senegalese twists or styles like that and i feel like you can actually use this to do full locks because of how soft it is it's not going to be like super stiff by the time you're done but yeah i really like this one and i'm also going to leave it down below in the description box if you guys want to check that out yeah, let me know what you guys think down below. Thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. You can subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button down below or my face on this side. Also, do not forget to watch my other natural hair videos on this side. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.